Hello, hello. Um, I come like in my uh, previous video, uh, I did a challenge for myself to finish this book in one month. So it has 31 pages and I had 28 days to complete it. So I said to myself one page or two pages a day with uh, a time limit of 30 minutes. So um, let's get started uh, with this flip. This was the first one I did. Mostly I used alcohol markers, glitter gel pen, um, soft gel crayons, um, some black fine liner. So um, I used everything I had uh, on this page. So this took me like less than 30 minutes. So that was the goal for this book. Um, here I was using some um, soft gel crayons with some stencils in the background. Um, I didn't do that uh, further in the book anymore because it took too much time and I'm not very happy with the ending result, so I didn't do that anymore. Um, this was a color palette, I think. I don't know anymore which were color palettes, which were challenges on Instagram, which ones were um, um, random marker challenges. I don't know. Um, it was like depending on the mood I was. Um, this was soft child crayons as well. I had on some hearts uh, in the background. This was the green color challenge of Carla Magana. So use every color green you have. So green gel pen, um, green glitter, green alcohol markers. Everything is green. This was based on a watermelon. This was a color palette. I'm sure of it. Mm, I think this was a random color challenge. No idea anymore. I have like a bunch of alcohol markers from the action and they finish very, very quickly. So I have like a ton of random colors. So I put them in a bag and um, I pick five or six um, random markers and I try to make something out of them. It's, it's a fun challenge. So if you don't want to be bothered with picking all the colors and um, yeah. I advise to do that. Here I bought some uh, neon pro markers from Winston and Newton and I wanted to try the green one. Here I wanted to try the yellow one. So these were very, very quick. So you can do actually in 30 minutes a lot. So I don't know if, if I can do it with uh, another book of Carla, um, but the sketchbooks, you definitely can do it. I have like two um, two color and chats on my YouTube channel if you want to see me work or want some tips or on how I approach these pages, you can always check. This is like a fun color palette. Yeah, if, I, if it has a lot of big hair, I just scribble it. It goes much easier, much quicker. And this was a challenge for uh, to do everything in blue. Like I said, 30 minutes. Great results, I love her books. This was also a random um, palette, but it works. I think the colors were together. This isn't something I would, I would, I would pick on Pinterest, but hey, that's the fun of the challenge. Again, the hair is scribbled with uh, two markers. Sometimes I added some extra lines in the background. Sometimes I don't, uh, depending on how busy the page is and how much time I have. Here I was trying to blend um, with my colors. It went okay. I'm not an expert in blending alcohol markers, but it is uh, a fun result. This was like pastel colors. I was trying to blend with the hair as well. I like the, the green to the orange.
this was a very ugly color palette, but hey, we made it work. This was a random color palette as well. I would never pick this one. I had a lot of uh, lovely comments on uh, Instagram. There were some lovely persons, uh, individuals that uh, followed my challenge. So leave me a comment if you want to do this challenge as well, maybe in a book you prefer, but uh, these books are very great. I like this one. No idea why, but I like this one. She had a lot of hair. I know I was spending too much time on the hair. And this one is great as well. This was my second last page. And this is the last one. Okay. So this was the book Aesthetica Synthetica by Carla Magana. Let me know in the comment what you think. Uh, are you going to do this challenge as well? You can also spread it like in two months. So one page every two or three days, uh, depending on um, how it works for you. Um, do you have a book? you want to complete uh, in this year and you're focusing on, let me know in the comments and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.